so hello and welcome to another video this is going to be a random one if you're into landscapes and the countryside and all things that look great and nice and beautiful turn off now it's not going to happen i'm in mad max wonderland i'm here at a location i would never have dreamt of coming to get found and parked up as you can see i'm parked up behind i'm going to stop here for tonight behind you you've got a mad max sculpture that I think it's absolutely one of the best things I've ever seen. It's just so, so randomly awesome. It's a massive big piece of metal that they're obviously destroying and pulling apart and that. And it's just like, I've never seen anything like this. And then I've got the big windmills and the wind turbines over going on that side. And I've also got behind me a small fishing village, which looks just absolutely great. So I'm gonna get a few shots around here, put a few up and then hopefully come back and do a little bit of proper video. Uh, maybe with a tripod out later on when I've got some lights going on, but this is just, amazing what a different vlog this is going to be now i don't even know if i'm supposed to be filming here or even have my camera out but this is what i've come to have a look at and uh, i thought i'd sneak down and have a quick look this evening it looks pretty awesome up close So I'm not sure whether the tide's coming in or going out, but I'm walking down to this little lighthouse at the moment because we're going to have the sky of all skies, the mother of skies. And I'm in an industrial, industrial landscape area and it's going to be pretty interesting to see what it's going to be like. But the light behind me at the moment going off over there against that uh, Mad Max power drone is something awesome. And I'm going to get yourself a few shots of it. But the light tonight is going to be ballistic. I think I've reached my limit because I don't think I can get around there safely enough because this water coming up on the end of this pier is pretty dangerous and I need to be round that side to get the light so I'm going to have to go back I think to get the light um, I'm just going to take a quick look over here to see what I can see yeah that's where I need to be seeing at that light there and uh, I just can't take the risk of that but what an awesome place this is going to be Ooh. I've got to watch that light. I've got to watch that water. I must be flipping mad, but I've made it round. And I've got a picture of the lighthouse through these railings. Um, yeah, I'm not going to stay around there long, but the sky is jet black and the sun's on it. There is some amazing photographs. I just not in the right location at the right time, but in the right area. So I'm going to make the most of this as best I can. But I think that one of the lighthouse is going to be pretty good.
Well, I had a bit of a lazy one this morning. Uh, I managed to get some decent pictures of the sunset last night, I think. Uh, some very Mad Maxi looking pictures. And I wasn't really planning on the sunrise this morning. I think I needed to catch up with a little bit of sleep. Um, but looking out against this way with my van, poking out, looking out against all this backdrop of the sea and these windmills and, that. and these windmills this morning just caught my eye. I managed to get a couple of amazing photographs and even the headland out in the distance with a little boy and things and I was waiting for the birds to fly through and, and I literally just sat in the van and just took pictures out of the van really this morning. Bamber direction um, up through Whitley Bay, Colour Coats Arch maybe. I don't quite know where I'm going to plan on ending up but I just enjoyed shooting this old derelict metal work and this machinery and stuff like that that was going on around here and uh, it just it looks amazing even this morning you know when you look at the foundry and things like that it just looks absolutely uh, phenomenal as you walk along and you've got all this big industry and stuff that's going on in the background and things like that the only problem is this building here had the lights on all night so it's dead bright but this is a really weird place and of course you still got your little fishing village down there so i'm just going to end the video here and make a bit of a weird one and do another one later on i think um so yeah thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and uh give us that thumbs up and i'll see you gosh only knows where so i don't know i'm just making it up as i go along i have no plan i'm just going to end up and see what happens and we've got a bit of blue sky today so it's probably not the best. Ciao for now.